Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me Fallen YouTube channel. Guys, you're not gonna freaking believe this, but we might have found a car that we like for Ed. You probably heard us talking about maybe a Crown Vic as one of the options. For a car, you know, that Cooper and I can work on and Ed can actually race when we go to the track. Most of you have already met my neighbor Ed by now. If not, you're gonna meet him in this video. I asked a bunch of people to leave comments on what they think Ed should drive, and there were a lot. We saw a Crown Victoria pop up a lot, Corvette, third gen Camaro, what else, Coop? Monte Carlo. And yeah, those are all good options. Oh, and Fox Body Mustang, all good options, but we just couldn't find anything in our area that was cheap. We want this car to be pretty cheap just because it's gonna be, you know, kind of a beater, something that we're really just gonna use for beating on, having fun, burnouts, racetrack shenanigans. And we actually just found a pretty good looking deal on a Crown Vic. It's a 2009, it's got 130,000 miles and I just offered the guy 1500 bucks. He only lives like two miles from our house. So we're gonna meet up with Ed right now and hopefully go check it out. And just for the people who are asking, I will still be the owner of the car. We'll all be insured on it and we'll all be able to use it. And we'll also be paying for everything as far as if we like LS swapped it or we are maybe even thinking coyote swapping it, putting like a five liter engine out of a Mustang. They're a lot more expensive, but we'll leave that for the future. We have a ton of options with this car being that it has a huge engine bay. It's just a big car altogether. We can do whatever we freaking want to this thing. So let's go check it out and hopefully we can make a deal with this guy. Dude, are you wearing your Texas Speed shirt today? Texas Speed, brother? Oh, you got Texas Speed? Ed, we found an 09 Crown Vic. You're kidding. 130,000 miles. Wow. And uh, we're gonna see what kind of deal we can get. Is that like an ex-police car? Yeah. Some dually came in. Yeah, okay. some dually truck did it. Did you a... do this? No, I thought this was you. Some random dually came in. I don't have in. a dually? I know your truck's not a dually. I figured you backed up and did another one. Alright, it might have been White Buffalo. What's he doing out there? I'll just run over anything. What does he have? Let's freaking do this. I'm freaking pumped. The last Crown Vic we had was just a trooper. Drug drivers! <laughs> oh no, he's going out! <laughs> oh shit! Oh my god! Oh god! <laughs> I'm hoping this one's the same. All right, dude, this thing's pretty nice, Ed. What do you think? No one's definitely smoked in this thing. It smells actually pretty decent. Make sure the transmission feels good. Yeah, that's what we're worried about. Yeah, Doesn't wanna, make any noises. I want to jiggle the suspension. See if there's any yeah. Here. Where's the air? Let's turn on the load so we can hear noises. Suspension's pretty tight. Yeah, See? nothing out of nothing out of order with the suspension here, folks. Let's let's hear it. <laughs> yeah, Not in the neighborhood. Yikes! Wow! Holy oh shit! <laughs> Man, she's that was down to first gear. Yeah, she's pretty quick. That wound out to almost six grand. On Woo! The Not bad. We got some room down there. Well. Steering seems pretty tight. Yeah. Feels great. Yeah, it does. Give her the true shakedown. Oh. Feels good. All right. 45. Yeah. 50. Got up to 50. You weren't even full throttling. Man, this seems like a great car. It's freaking clean. I mean, it is just nice and clean. I'll tell you, if this was a cop car, it was a... Uh, this was a nice one, yeah. They maintained it. Yeah, here, let me, let me drive it real quick. Okay, here, let me pull in here. The power steering is silent, which is good. Yeah. God damn. She's quick. I'm telling you. Do you think she's worth 1500 bucks? Oh, hell yeah. Yeah? Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. You heard it here, guys. She's you worth, heard it here from neighbor Ed. <laughs> she's worth fifteen hundred. All right, guys, it's official. We have a Crown Vic. They're getting their stuff out. You got a name, Ed? I got a name. I'm gonna call it Neighbor. 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 <laughs> Just neighbor. Neighbor. It's a beautiful name. It means a lot of beautiful things. I think that could work. Yeah. What do you think? Who? That's that's a good name. I do like neighbor. Just neighbor. We're taking neighbor. The neighbor. All right. Uh, I dig it. Everybody meet neighbor the Crown Vic. Dude, this thing runs like a dream. 
I'm pumped. This is basically the only thing we're gonna have to patch. It's just that hole in the bumper. Otherwise, it's super, super clean for a Crown Vic, especially a cop car. Damn, I'm pumped. We got a Crown Vic. That did not take long to add a car to the collection. Gotta give it the burnout test. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. She's purring. Oh yeah. Already does a great burnout. I'm freaking ecstatic about this thing. Can you guys freaking believe it? We now have a Ford on the channel, a Dodge on the channel, and a Chevy. Even though this is just a cheap Crown Vic, I am so freaking excited to see where it's gonna go. I, I hope this turns into an actually cool project car that we can take drag racing and actually be kind of fast. Why did we not find a Crown Vic project car earlier? I'm, I can't believe I'm this excited about this, honestly. Now we have to decide whether or not we LS swap it, we coyote swap it, we freaking diesel swap it. The possibilities are endless. This thing, I mean, as much as it drives so good right now, I think it just immediately needs an LS engine and possibly a stick shift transmission. How sick would that be? Dude, I'm so happy with this. Yeah, Ed, did you see that? It's already yeah, got I didn't a, know what that was. It's got a mount for your nitrous bottle. Oh, no, it's a fire extinguisher. No, no, we're going nitrous okay. for that one. Yeah, so what do you think, Ed? I think it's a wonderful deal. Wonderful hey, deal, wonderful car. Here. Ed? Oh, you got to push with your left foot. It's got this safety lockout thing. Push down with your left foot on just... No, 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 on the pedal. Off the pedal. On the ground. Look. There you go. Now you can put it in gear. Yeah. Oh. Back this old girl up and let her rip. Give her hell. Oh, you got one going. Hold it. Hold it. Yes. Yes. All right. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, geez. Look at this, my God. Tearing it up. Ed, that's going to be you, though, soon enough. <laughs> yeah, well, not if you guys keep burning up the tires. <laughs> Shit. Look at this. He melted the damn asphalt. I know. Well, good thing it came with brand new freaking tires. Good Lord. Look at that. Cooper just laid a nice one. Yeah, he did. Did I just obtain first and second on the list? Oh, I don't know. That's going to be up to the people. Uh, well, they'll have to vote. Look I don't at think. The mark. I know that's a nice mark, but not a chance it's better than White Buffalo's. No way. Really? There was so much smoke. There was a lot of smoke. There was a lot of smoke. There, these are these are good burnout tires. They yeah. Are. I'm calling Mike and we're about to call him out right now. Hey, hey Mike. We just we just bought a Crown Vic and we're calling out the C4. You ain't gonna do your shit. Oh, you're done. That slow pile of is going down. <laughs> we gotta modify them a little bit. What do you what do you want? I don't know. What, what do you want me to do to my car? I'm just putting nitrous on the Crown Vic and taking it up there. And I'm dragging the C4. That's all you need to know. I was thinking like next to spring we have like a car challenge with project cars. All right, I'll be down for that. All right. Well, just know that the C4 ain't going to be sleeping good tonight. She knows the just crown. Know, just know that the C4 is going to be sleeping just fine. <laughs> All right, buddy. We'll see ya. All right, buddy. I'll see you soon. See ya. Well, there you guys go. We have a new project car for the channel. Much to come for this. Still a lot to do for that and everything else we have. But for now, thanks for watching. Do it for Dale, and we will see you later. Well, dang, hope you enjoyed your time on the Cletus McFarlane YouTube channel. Check out some of our t-shirts. We've got the Do It For Dale t-shirt, the Do It For America t-shirt, and of course the Twin Turbskies t-shirt, all of which can be found in the link in the description below. If you liked what you saw, please subscribe and check out this video that we posted earlier this week.